सोर्स ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन क्वेश्चन यूजिंग सोर्स कन्वर्जन कन्वर्ट द गिवन सर्किट इनटू एन इक्विवेलेंट सर्किट कंटेनिंग सिंगल रेजिस्टेंस एंड वोल्टेज सोर्स सोल्यूशन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल कन्वर्ट दिस वोल्टेज सोर्स इनटू इट्स इक्विवेलेंट करंट सोर्स सो टू कन्वर्ट हेयर दिस विल बी आवर स्टेप नंबर वन कन्वर्ट थ्री वोल्ट वोल्टेज सोर्स टू करंट सोर्स नाउ हेयर इफ वी कन्वर्ट दिस थ्री वोल्ट वोल्टेज सोर्स टू करंट सोर्स इट विल बी इन पैरल विथ दिस वन होम सो इट विल बी इट विल लुक लाइक दिस in parallel with this one ohm also the direction of this current source will be in this direction because the polarity of this 3 volt voltage source is positive on right side and negative on left side so it will be look like this now again according to ohm's law current i is equal to v by r voltage value is 3 volt and resistance value is 1 so the current value will be 3 ampere so this will be of 3 ampere now we can remove this voltage source from here now we will convert this 12 volt voltage source into its equivalent current source so our step number 2 will be convert 12 volt voltage source to current source now we will copy this and we will convert 12 volt voltage source into its equivalent current source now again when we convert voltage source to current source then it will be in parallel with this resistance so here the direction of this current source will be leftward because the polarity of this 12 volt voltage source is positive here and negative here now according to ohm's law i is equal to v by r the voltage value is 12 and the resistance value is 4 so it will be again 3 ampere so this will be of 3 ampere now we have to erase this now we will solve these parallel current sources and parallel resistances so first we will copy this and then our step number 3 will be solve current sources in parallel now here we can see this is 6 ampere on left side this 3 ampere is also on left side so this will be the leading direction so now we will erase this 6 ampere from here or we can directly solve it here first so it will be 6 we can take current i on left side because this direction is leading because 6 ampere and 3 ampere are on left side and this 3 ampere is on right side so it will be 6 then plus 6 plus 3 and minus 3 ampere we are taking this minus 3 ampere because its direction is opposite of this 6 ampere and 3 ampere so it will be 6 ampere now again we will copy this and we will erase this 6 ampere current source and this 3 ampere current source and then the equivalent current source will be on left side and its value will be 6 ampere so this will be of 6 ampere 
now we will solve this resistances in parallel so our next step will be step number 4 solve resistances solve resistances in parallel so when we solve this resistances in parallel this will be 1 upon R E Q is equal to 1 upon 8 plus 1 upon 1 plus 1 upon 4 1 upon 8 plus 1 upon 1 plus 1 upon 4 so this will be the value of 1 upon R E Q and this will be 1 upon 8 plus 1 plus 1 upon 4 so it is 11 by 8 11 by 8 then R E Q will be equal to 8 by 11 8 by 11 ohm now we will redraw this circuit and here this will be removed from here and this is also removed from here and this will be of 8 by 11 ohm 8 by 11 ohm will be the value of this resistance now here we can see this is a current source in parallel with resistance now next step will be convert step number 5 convert 6 ampere current source 6 ampere current source to voltage source 6 ampere current source to voltage source so it will be look like this here this is terminal A and this will be a voltage source in series with resistance this will be terminal B the value of resistance is 8 by 11 ohm so this will be 8 by 11 ohm now the polarity for this voltage source will be here we can see the current flowing in leftward direction so here this will be positive and this will be negative and again according to ohm's law v is equal to i into r the value of current is 6 ampere and the value of resistance is 8 by 11 ohm so 8 by 11 so this will be 6 into 8 by 11 6 into 8 by 11 so it is 4.36 4.36 volt so here this will be 4.36 volt so this is the final circuit this is our final circuit for this question